Defensively, and that was Sandoval in the last sequence offensively. Yeah. So she was you know. involved in that two on one. Yep. Yeah. Oh, what a redirect by Templeman and the finish! Wow, the shot came out of the corner from Emily Harley and Templeman off the heel of the stick just directs it in and it's one zip Robert Morris. They do get the first goal. Yeah, Harley, Templeman, and uh, I believe Corona was with that line, but yeah, she found the puck in the corner. It was a little chip play off the wall and uh, good play by Harley, threw it in front and just a redirect by Templeman. Lakers. We'll carry it in. Trailing 1-0. Slap shot. Fiesler save made. Rebound. Score. The rebound bounces out. I think it was Newton over in that circle, and it was Emma Newton in her first goal of the weekend. And ties the game at one, and there's still 4.07 of power play time left. Newton, that's her 15th goal of the year, so she's got the rebound. She's out about the dot, the dot to the left of Desmond, and she just snapped it to the far side into the netting and yep. initial save by Desmond. We get contact with the head. Charge to Kirsten Welsh. And Corona heads up ice. Possible two on one here with Harley. Corona with Isbell back. Corona holds, 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 waits, and it goes in. It went off of Harley and went in, and the Colonials get a shorthanded goal to regain the lead. It's two to one. How about that action? Corona just holding <laughs> yeah, on forever. Yeah, waiting, waiting, and took the shot, a smart move, but it, it went off of Harley's skate, it appeared. So I don't know if they're going to look at this. The Mercyhurst is asking. Let's, let's watch it on the replay here. Seems to take forever to develop here. The play is under review. I certainly didn't see any kick on that play. It was redirected. I, I, mean, I don't know what the exact rule was in college, but I don't think there was a distinct kicking motion. Well, they, they, they looked at it quickly, and that's a goal. One goal lead for Robert Morris, 8.45 to go. And hooking is the call. And against Curlett, and uh, Rice just kind of protects the puck, allowing Desmet to cover it up. And Ariel Desmet, good hockey game so far. She has stopped 16 of 17 shots she's faced. And a save made by Desmet. Desperately need a clear here. Two seconds to go, and they'll get one player back. Shot a save made. Desmet then gloves it out of the air as Curlett comes out of the box. And Desi looking calm right now, yeah. Bobby. Yeah. see your goaltender is your best penalty killer, and Desmet has been here as the Colonials just collapsing with those three players just trying to, they're giving the shot up and just trying to box out after the shot. Into the center for Blazin. His right side, Newton. In. Now Blazin again. Rister. Good block by Lequeux. Long feet for Hine. Hine, though, knocked it down but had to come back for it. And that allowed the Colonials to recover on defense. Isbell directs one towards it. Oh, there's a shot and a big save by Desmond. It's still loose in front. The whistle blows. A puck came out into the slot area behind the crowd. Desmet with a huge save up high. Wow, that was a huge save. I believe I think she got the glove hand up on that, huh, Darryl? And a high shot from in tight. And Desmet loved that puck. Let's see the replay here. There you see she had to stop for that puck, otherwise it was a breakaway. And here comes the shot. Boom. Yep, gets that glove on there. Sadoui winds up with a puck. Corona gives it back to number 17. Answers away from Vasco. Still with it is J.C. Gebhardt. Looking for her first goal of the weekend. Curlett's shot. Save. Mead rebound. Score! And the Colonials take a 3-1 to one lead on a delayed penalty. 
What a hockey game here in Pittsburgh. And what a response from Robert Morris. Still 9.03 to go, but the Colonials get the power play goal and will get the goal on the delayed penalty. And now we'll go on the power play. Ah, I like that rule. I like that. Okay, pluses. So what's the um, uh, explanations being given and clarifications to both benches? Robillard gives one to the left side for not. Turns and shoots one in a cool save from Desmet. And you see Ariel. Great day for her today. Getting the Saturday afternoon start. 109 left in the Mercyhurst Minor. Goes it left side, and there goes Kennedy Blair off the ice. Extra attacker on for the Lakers. Trailing by two with a minute 40 to go. Kicking at it is Tanskinen. Trying to get it over to Newton. And works free Templeman. Lost her stick, so she runs up and kicks it out of the zone. <laughs> and now Harley pushes it forward to herself. Harley gets to it and buries it. And it's 4-1 Robert Morris. And then Harley turning on the speed after the kick out of the zone on the other end. And good hard work for the Colonials. And uh, Templeman's going to get an assist <laughs> with, with her skate. He kicked wow. it to the neutral zone to clear it, and Harley. What a game for number 10. And Harley has her second goal of the game. Wow. Templeman, a three-point night. And it's 4-1 Robert Morris. And time expires. <laughs> and the Colonials celebrate victory here on the island. What a hockey game and what an effort. A great response today.